We're still here at Embedded World 2023, and you may be familiar with Blues Wireless. Now, I'm here with uh, Rob Lauer from Blues Wireless. You've heard me talk about their stuff before. There's a bunch of projects on our website. We have a featured platform all about Blues Wireless that you can find on the Electromaker website. There'll be links to that in this video and in the blog post that goes with this video. But, Rob, for those who may not be initiated, what is Blues Wireless? What are you folks making? Sure, so primarily we are focused on cellular IoT. So we build the Note Card, which is a prepaid cellular module. Comes with 10 years of service, global, 500 megabytes of data. We're really geared towards the IoT developer who is trying to push sensor data to the cloud. So we're low bandwidth, relatively high latency, trying to target that specific uh, developer who's you know, pushing whatever kind of sensor data that you might be wanting to push to the cloud. Um, so we have a variety of demos here at Embedded World. I can show you off one in particular that I love is our, uh, is our pump jack. So this is a oil and gas, or a, an oil pump jack that you might find in Texas, for instance. And our note card here is monitoring the motion of the jack. So there's an onboard accelerometer and a GPS module on the pump jack so it can track the location of the jack as well as the number of times it moves up and down. And you'll, what's key about this is if the pump jack stops moving, it'll send a notification to the cloud that, hey, you have a pump jack in the field that's no longer functioning. You better send a tech out to check it out, which is a great way of, of course, lowering costs you know, for field techs and all that kind of good stuff. So. Just one of many you know, great examples that we have here. If, if anybody's at Embedded World, you want to come on down and check it out, it'd be great. Absolutely, yeah. And um, and one thing about the note card that, um, that I like, I, but I am not an engineer, so please forgive me if what I say is absolutely wrong, and please do correct me. But the, the note card itself, as you say, is based on cellular IoT. Yes. And it is something that could be used uh, sort of as a co-processor, right? So you could use this to add GPS to a project that already has its yes. own host MCU. Correct. But it's also something that you can just use it completely as a standalone no, you're thing, exactly right? right? Is that yeah. right? Yeah, okay. so this one is a completely standalone uh -huh. uh, project. Right. But the nice thing is you can hook it up to an existing host. So we have a hidden back here, and right over here is a uh, uh, two examples of adding a host to your to your project as well, so you can program it to do to read sensor data from virtually any sensor out there, and hook it up to any microprocessor as well. We don't dictate the hosts, we don't dictate the sensors, we don't dictate the programming language. Although we're in the Zephyr booth, so I will say we recommend using Zephyr. But um, yeah, so it's very flexible. Applies to many many use cases out there. Absolutely, yeah. And as I mentioned at the start of this video, we have a whole feature platform on electromaker.io about the Blues Wireless note card and everything else that they do. If you are interested in finding out more or buying a, anything from Blues Wireless, uh, head to the link in the description of this video or in our accompanying blog post and you'll find everything you need to know there. Rob, thanks so much for chatting to me hey, today. Thank you, Ian. Cheers.